Well, he lasted just four months. Michael Tree, who in February became Golden Empire Transit's first new chief executive in 15 years, was fired this morning. What happened? 17's Robert Price explains what we know. Officials with Golden Empire Transit, the county's not-for-profit bus agency, were thrilled to announce in February the selection of Michael Tree as the new CEO, a Porterville native with experience and vision. Jet is singing a different tune now, two different tunes actually. One is the bus company's official line, confirming with little further comment the rumor that Tree is no longer employed. The other is that of GET employees demanding answers about the departure of a new boss who got things done and ingratiated himself in less than half a year. But employees, bus drivers specifically, say they're barred from speaking publicly about it and threatened with termination if they do. Tree took over on February 20th, succeeding Karen King, who retired after serving GET for 15 years. Tree had served as the CEO and general manager of the Santa Cruz Metropolitan Transportation District and as executive director of a regional rail authority based in Livermore. He helped end a stalemate with the union representing GET bus drivers and laid out an in principle partnership with Uber and Lyft that would reduce the number of mostly empty full size buses. Something clearly happened along the way with GET's five person board of directors who canceled Tuesday afternoon's scheduled meeting. A group of bus drivers had reportedly planned to attend and demand answers. Board Chairwoman Cindy Parra did not have a comment prepared by airtime. Efforts to contact Tree were not successful. The bus drivers union declined to comment. In Bakersfield, Robert Price, 17 News.